Hello guys, Mario and Sonic for the win here, back again for another figure review. This time it's on some odd pieces that I picked up last night at my local mall. From what I know, they're official by PopGo, and they seem to be bath toys, which is a bit odd. But they're chibi, they're cute, and they're just pretty cool collector's pieces overall. But also I picked up a little gem of sorts, and I will go get that right now. But really, it is this Bowser Jr. wicked awesome keychain of him in his little clown car. And this thing is extremely small, even for a keychain. But it has some really good details, and I believe this was an import from Japan. But like I said, I got it from my mall. And this isn't by any means new, if this will show up. It is from the game New Super Mario Bros. Wii, if you can see that. So that's kind of an older game, but this is a nice stretchy keychain, and I saw this, picked it up immediately, because I've never seen one, and it's really awesome, I'm hanging it on my wall. Let me go do that, and we'll get back to the real review. Okay, with distractions aside, we will now start with Mario, because he's the main character. Okay, so despite being chibi and kind of odd looking, to say the least, because he's all squished down, he looks pretty nice, I mean, they got all the colors right. They missed a little bit of a detail on the gloves because of those little, you know, circles that they have. But that's alright. And the colors are all good. His nose is nicely shaped. He looks really good for a little, you know, water figure because that's what I think they are based on the little hole in the mouth. And in the shoes to obviously let water in. And unless someone's committing fraud, you know, this is official because it says copyright Nintendo. So, I do believe this is official. Based on the box it was in, it looked like Popco's work, but it didn't really say it anywhere, so I'm not really sure who this is by, but Mario looks very good, and there's not really much to say, so now I will go to Luigi. Okay, so like Mario, Luigi looks just as good, and he has kind of a different he has a completely different sculpt, actually, than Mario now that I look at it, and I like the colors that they used on him. The overalls are very nice. The hat color is very nice. The L is on center, so they did some good things for a small little chibi figure. And he's in a different pose than Mario, so it's not the same thing with just different colors, which I like. And he is also a squirt toy. I believe they all are, as I said. And he's pretty much the same as Mario, but he looks very nice. And he's just another cool little figurine to add to your collection. Okay, so Yoshi. Yoshi looks extremely good, I mean, he's kind of chibi already if you think of it, so there's not much that they had to change on this guy, except for, you know, squishing down his feet. I had to put some clay down on his feet because he would not stand, so it kind of destroys the purpose of a squirt toy, but I only collect, I don't really play with the things I buy, so. He's a nice display piece, and I believe the nostrils are where he squirts water at. And they got all the bumps right and the little shell right there, so. He looks very good too, and very reminiscent of the 5 inch Popgo Yoshi, which looks a lot like this, so that's Yoshi. Now DK, he looks pretty good, but kind of odd in a way. I think it's the fact that his eyes aren't very close together, but they did include his tie, and he is in a different pose than all the others. And one thing that I like is they included all the tufts of hair from Donkey Kong, considering he is a gorilla. So that's a very nice feature, and there you can see that's where he squirts his water out, oh, that little hole in there. And once again, it says copyright Nintendo, 2010 China on the bottom. So these are official again. And this is also reminiscent of the PopGo 5 inches because of the tufts of hair, and the texture on this one feels a bit different than the others, and this actually feels like the 5 inches. So I like DK a lot, but my only complaint is that it's not to scale with the others because he's kind of smaller than Mario, and that's just not very likely. Toad looks pretty good too, actually. I like his face, and as you can see, the hole in his mouth again. But his head is very big, because he's chibi, and of course they squish down the feet. So I mean, this kind of looks like a regular Toad figure, because Toads usually have big heads and small bodies, so that's kind of average. And now this is where I would be confused, as if this were a squirt toy. It says copyright Nintendo on the head, but there's no really big hole to let water in. Except for that little hole on top, so, I mean, 
This is more of a display figure, I would say. Even though there are, they all are from the same series, which baffles me. But I really like him, and he is made of the same texture of Mario and Luigi. But he's very nice, and you know, you gotta get one, you gotta get the full collection. Is always my mentality when getting these figures. So, if you see them, pick them up. Now, Koopa. Koopa Troopa is one of the guys that I don't really own too much merchandise on, so it was nice seeing him, and I knew I had to get him immediately also. I like the way they did his shell, it's kind of a different plastic feel, and the hexagons and pentagons are very well defined with this little indentation in the dark black, I really like that. And he is basically like Yoshi, except for a recolor, sort of. But they did his eyes different, and... They made him a completely different figure because of the sculpt, and they added the ridges, and so it's basically the same, but he looks different. And, you know, the water hole, again, and copyright Nintendo. And these are a great buy, I mean, there's six of them, and for $4 each, how could you beat it? I mean, $24 for all those, very nice figures. Pick them up if you see them, I haven't seen them everywhere, so I don't know if that means they're rare. Or their bootleg, I don't know. Either way, very nice miscellaneous collectibles. This has been Mario and Sonic for the win, signing off for another figure review. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like, and thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.